Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. Right the way along, that's going to uncover a little bit of this algae. We'll have some of that for oxygen generation. And I can build some food storage places over this side as well. Carbon dioxide in here, which means that I ought to be able to move that ration box up a layer or two. Should be helpful. Even if I just move the ration box up there, it's up a little bit higher than it was. Build a new ration box. Right, I'll do that. Where is food? Ration box. Let's put one there. One new ration box up a little bit higher. We'll deliver some sandstone in there. And then I'll take that one. I will copy settings and I'll put it on there. So hopefully they'll use this one instead of this one down here. What have we got? I've got natural gas up there. There's no germs in this bit, is there? That's germs. Carbon dioxide. Polluted oxygen. Yeah, there's germs around here. But there isn't much in the way of germs up here. I've got regular oxygen up here. And then we've got carbon dioxide sort of mixed with natural gas. This is cleaning this area out. Trying to remove any carbon dioxide. So I've got bits of natural gas floating around. And then we've got plenty of oxygen in here as well. Dirt being delivered over there. There's the last bits. I refuse to go any further until I have complete... Ooh, right. We've now... Printing pod. What are we going to do with you? Let's have a look. Uh, choose a blueprint. I don't think I want any more of these at the moment. I think we can leave that. we got uh, a Drecklet egg. Drekos are non-hostile critters that graze only on live mealwood plants. Their backsides are covered in thick woolly fibers that only grow in hydrogen climates. There's eggs available at the moment. We've got 3,000 kilos of fertilizer. Aids in the growth of certain plants. Immune to food poisoning, iron gut. But she does have a stress reaction of vomiting, which is not so good. Quite so sure about that. Uh, ugly Cryer, Balloon Artist, Agriculture and Excavation. I won't take any more for a minute. We'll go with Fertilizer there. I will print the Fertilizer off. And uh, I'll go here. Duplicate Skills. Hassan has leveled up. He can take Improved Carrying 2. Oh, no, he can't. He's got Hard Digging. Super Hard. Su oh, no. Super Duper Hard Digging. Put Hassan into a morale deficit and cause un... Wait, what? Diamond and obsidian mining. Learning super duper hard digging will put Hassan into a morale deficit and cause unnecessary stress. Hassan is interested in learning super duper hard digging and will receive a morale bonus for learning it. Wait, what? I don't understand. We'll put him into a morale deficit... And cause him stress. But at the same time, it will... Alright. I don't really understand why it's got to be both. But I guess it's because uh, some of these... It's a little bit difficult for them to learn. That's, that's what I'm assuming. Is It's a little bit difficult for some of them to learn these things. So I could go there and do improve construction. Bedside manor in here. I'm going to do that. Oh, wait. The red bit. Morale needed. Morale three. Terrible meal. That cycles decor. Poor. Zero. Morale need one. Skills learned. Then if I take you. Like that. Skills learned plus three. Morale four. Oh, that's the morale need in there. Uh, Hassan over here. Skills learned plus six is morale is needed. Uh, morale, interested skills learned three. Duplicant one. Two shift break one. Last cycle, grizzly meal minus one. All right. We'll have to keep an eye on him. We'll do, we'll be start working on improved construction for him next, I think. Although that also puts him at a morale deficit, doesn't it? I'm quite sure. I, I, I'm not 100% sure how that works. It seems to work fairly well. They seem to be okay with it. We've just... Just those few little bits there to clean. If you could just do those over there. 
They'd be absolutely wonderful. Why do they keep coming down here? Oh, they're, they're dumping stuff in here. They're picking up the ores. No, they're running. Yeah, they're picking up. Picking up Igneous Rock over here. Carrying up backwards and forwards. It's quite heavy. Oh, I see. I've got an awful lot of it over here. And it's heavy. So they can only pick up so much of it at a time. But they are rushing backwards and forwards. And they are actually able to get most of it and bring it away. Oxygen is barely breathable. We are fast running out of oxygen. Right. My dreams of cleaning everything up are going to have to be put on hold. Now, I do have an idea of what I can do here. I've got a little bit of organic material in there that we'll be able to use. So if I take a tile here and I run that right the way across there like that. That's just going to clean things up a little bit. I'm going to leave the tank for a second. Yes, that's what I'm going to do it like that. And I'm going to go with this. And I'm going to dig all that lot out. Right. Let them work through there for a minute. They'll get through this pretty quick, but we're going to have stuff down here that we then want them to take care of. We've got all this sandstone and stuff like that. So, oh, we've also got the... Um, the, 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 the thingy down there is, is busy drowning. I'm, I'm not sure if it's a good idea to have him in there while he's busy drowning. And then we've also got all of this other stuff as well. And... Oh, hello. Right, now we've got additional water. It's, it's sort of been squashed into there. And that's also not a good thing. So I'd like, ideally, to be able to turn this into a basin that is completely blocked off. It doesn't have any other sort of problems or anything like that. Uh, the other thing we want to do is we want to capture this shine bug and we want to put that one just into the farm and also like have the farm so that it's properly capturable. So we, we've got a couple of different bits that we're going to need to do. That in there, that storage bin, I want to make a compost thing so that we can get that, uh, we, we can start clearing away the production of the oxygen like that. that that's going to also cause us a problem. Uh, the polluted oxygen is coming off of there. And I've got a load of water over here. Now that is a bit of a problem. We need them to get rid of that. So what we're going to do here, I've got all of this carbon dioxide is unbreathable, but I got carbon dioxide being pulled in from there. So the next bit of this little plan that I want to do is I want to go into the base in here and I want to build... First up, we want to build a ladder to come down here like this to that height. Actually, no, we're going to go right down to... Ooh. You know, we have got water all the way down here. I could run this all the way down to the bottom and we could have a big tank. Now, I don't know how far down that pipe goes on the water pump whether that would go all the way down here there's a lot of water in here i mean what i could do is not have it go all the way down there that could end up being a little bit daft so i don't know if that water pipe would extend all the way down if i've got like a, a deeper pool or not there is only one way to find out. If we've got to make the pool a bit different, then we will make it a bit different. But we've got water in here, and I'd like to have that water sort of cleaned out. Plus, I've got algae down here as well, which I want to use. So I'm going to go with tile here. We've got airflow tiles, mesh tiles. We don't want to use any of them. And I want to bring tile here. I want to bring that along there like that. And then I want to run tile down here. So I've got a double wall. I... I I really want to extend the wall out between there. I'm actually going to cancel those to start with. And instead, I'm going to go back into tile. And I'm going to tile in there. Like that. And that's going... I'm not going to go any further than that. So I'm going to have three layers of tile between this dirty water storage and this bit over here. That's just to start off with. Right, that is only to start off with. And then what we're also going to do is we're going to build a wall down here like this that they will then be able to get through and do. And it's going to require them going underwater a little bit. Cancel. No, I don't want to cancel. What do I want to do to get through that? Uh, dig. Deconstruct. 
There, deconstruct that bit. So we'll have them dig that bit out, and then I've got the wall is coming over here. I'm going to want to remove that, actually, because I want to bring that wall all the way down here. I'm going to have a double skin along the bottom, and that's going to be three skin there because of the dirty water over here. I want to make sure there is no danger of the water getting through that bit over there, and then the rest of it is... We'll have a, we'll have a double skin on the rest of it, so I'm going to want another skin down at, at just a little bit further down, so I'm going to cancel that, and instead of having that, we go here into the base, and we will go one tile further down. Down to here. Or down to here. No, not there. Not, not there. We'll, we'll go here. That, that's, where, that's where it's going to be. It's going to go out to over to there, and like that. And then this is going to come over this side. And it's going to go up there like that. That's kind of where we're going to start off with it. I'll cancel that bit in there. And then I will also go with dig. And I'm going to start by digging out some of this down the bottom. So we're going to want the dig tool. And we're going to dig out that bit under there. And then that bit there. And we're also going to dig some of this around here. Which is going to open up that. I've got plans. I, I will actually be able to get through and do all of this. Although I'm thinking maybe we should cancel that. No, I don't need to cancel that. But I will cancel that. Digging escapade. But I won't cancel that. And that way then I can start digging from the top down. That would be a better way of doing this. So let's... Uh, we'll dig that bit out as well. And then... Cancel those three. Okay. That, I think, is where I kind of want this to start off with. Just just to be going for now. I think that would be sufficient. Now, we want to go and have a look on you in here. No, I want to have a look at that one. And I want to go to research in here. We have got everything in there researched. I can't do any more until I build a supercomputer, can I? So we've got, we've got the basic research table. I think I do actually have to build the new one in order to be able to do it. Now, what's wrong with you? Unbreathable. Growth halted. Right, someone made a mess. <gasps> oh dear. Polluted water. Food poisoning. That is the worst possible thing that could have happened. Is they've now gone and polluted my water. I've got food poisoning in my water right here. That water is, is now useless. I'm gonna... I don't know what to do about that. Well, there is a thing that we can do to clean this water up. That's a mop. Not on floor. What on earth am I gonna do about that? I have to... Too much liquid. Uh, unreachable. But now I've just gone and polluted all... I've, I've, I've basically, I've gone and broke through into the water over here. And didn't think about this properly. Because it's this. It's this bit right here. This, this is the problem. I can at least clear... Can I clear that bit? Mop tool polluted water. Right, well, I've managed to get a little bit of that. Mop tool. That's too much liquid, and then that's not on the floor. I can't... I can't do anything else. I've got... I've got no other options right now, apart from allowing this to just keep going with what I've already started. So I'm digging that out, and I'm clearing a few bits away. Uh... They have gone and done that, and the germs... Right. Germs germs are decreasing on here. Ooh, problem. Base. Ladder. Down there. I don't know if they can... This, this is a problem. I, I don't know if he can go up by two. 
Long commutes, suffocating. Unless they can actually get that one, this duplicate is going to die. Build that one, build that, build that ladder, build that ladder. He's, he's going to get up there. He's, he's, get, get up the ladder. Oh, thank goodness for that. That was close. That was pretty close. That was very, very close. We, we, we nearly had a major, major problem right there. Okay, we need to mop up that lot right there. And building toilets was another important thing that we wanted to do. We've got more that needs to be cleaned up there. And we've got more that needs to be cleaned up there. So let's build some actual toilets over this side. We've got lavatory there. One, two, three toilets right in there I think would do absolutely wonderfully. We're going to need to be able to get water coming in. I need a liquid pump. Right. Let's not worry about that. We'll let them build that for a minute. But what I'll do is I'll build a second outhouse down here just for a minute as well. That's, um, that, that will help the situation, I think. If they've got a second outhouse down here... They'll at least be able to do something with it. We've got a bit of cleaning up to do here. I think we have dealt with the whole food poisoning bit in here. There are some germs in here, which is not ideal. Germs, food poisoning. So there is some germs in here, which definitely is, is not is not a really good thing. But it's it's you know it's it's, it's kind of better than it was, I suppose. Uh, I'll clear that bit off of there, and then they'll be able to come back in here and do the rest of that. I hope. I've got no water that's able to come out of there, so we have got a shortage of water. Just got to wait for them to go through the night, and then they can build up the outhouses over here as well. You come in and go into there, and I'll allow them to fill this up. So, yes, this situation down here with the germs... They're picking, they are picking up water. They're coming down and picking up water for these different bits. So that at least is, is kind of a good thing. Let's go into here for the skill points. Duplicate skills. Lindsay! You've got grilling and cooking right now. So uh, you've actually already got number two on here, haven't you? Yeah, you, you've already got that. So you haven't got any others that you really love. What do we know about you, Lindsay? What do we know? Ooh, select hat. Grilling too. So what does the hat do? Oh, that just basically assigns for the different things, does it? Or what? I, I'm not quite sure. What What do the hats do? Take you. I need, I need you to have skill points. Improved carrying, supplying, 4 plus 400. Improved tinkering, medicine, compounding. Improved strength for tidying. I will put you on improved strength down there so that we've got some extra... On to you. Now, you in here, you are an artist. So, your hat at the moment, aesthetic design. We give you an aesthetic design hat. And you are a researcher. Ellie, over here. Actually, you're not. You're a critter. Uh, a critter. You're a, you're a critter rancher. So, we'll, we'll put that one on you. Then, Frankie over here is electrical engineering. We do that, and then you over here. You are the you're the digging dude, super hard digger. He is the man with that one. And down here, I've got four of three field research, advanced research. So what's the field research? Plus two science, geographical analysis, supercomputer usage. Kind of want to give you that one, but I mean, I'll go with that one there. I don't know if the hat is, like, am I, what does the hat do? I'm not really sure what the hat does. So, bedside manner for the doctoring one. And then Abe over here, his best one. Well, at the moment, all he's got is improved construction. We will go for the construction too when he's got it available. So, we'll put him on that one. And then Ashkan over this side is a carrier. So, he's going to go improved carrying like that. I don't know if this is, a, this is something I'm supposed to do. We will soon find out. They, they've got their various different abilities right here. They, they still seem to be doing all of the other jobs. 
That was my one concern, was they weren't going to go and do all of the other jobs, which I wanted them to do. I've got these bits in here. I would like them to come and get the dirty water that's under here, because I think that's going to help with the whole germs that we've got in the water. There's some germs in here, but there's not very much. It does at least seem to be sort of dissipating a little bit, which which is a good thing. I'm, I'm quite pleased about that. Now, I've got... Water has been picked up, and they can come down and they can gather clean water into these different areas. We will go with our mop. And I will mop up that lot. And then this in here, we're not going to do anything that. So they've still got some more digging to do down the bottom. Which I want them to do, and I want them to fill in all of this as well, which they will keep doing as well. They're going to keep just, This is just stuff that they're going to keep working on. And then we've got to dig down layer by layer, I think, in order to properly be able to do this. So they're starting to pick stuff up and move it around. We've got the outhouses over here. We've got the toilets for ready for when I can put the dirty water in. Now, this is the, this is the thing with the plumbing. I've got another one of these, like this one here. I'm going to want to expand this one out. I'm going to want a bigger tank on here. But before I get to that, I want this side done. So all of this has got to be done first. So what we're going to do next, I think, is we're going to go into our base. We're going to go to tiles like this, and I'm going to put tile across there like that. And put a bit of tile in there. And then I'm going to... Right, they're, they're doing the tile in there. Then I'm going to dig that and those two and that and that out there. Cancel those two. And I'm going to dig those out like that. i got to dig that bit out over there. So what I'm going to need to do in order to be able to dig that out is we're going to need to go with some tiles here like this. Just put that in. I'm really concerned that at some of these guys might end up causing us some problems with pollution. Pollution is a problem for me. I don't want them peeing in here. This is my main tank. I've got to just persuade them not to pee in the main tank. So long as they can avoid peeing in the main tank, we're all right. So I've, I've gone and put that wall in there, just that floor, so that they can access all of that. And then I want to remove that. And I want them to go somewhere else. We've got food poisoning there. Meal lice unrefrigerated. All right, food poisoning's not good. People seem to be doing okay. Printing pod in here. Duplicate skills. Joshua over this side is ready for masterwork decorating over here. We'll receive a morale bonus for earning it and it will cause him unnecessary stress if he goes for it as well. So if I have him learn that, it's now caused him unnecessary stress. I'm not sure it was a good thing, but we will go with Master... He's going to have the Masterwork hat, and then you over here, you've got Critter Ranching, Critter Ranching too. So if I go with the Crop Tending, we'll put both of these on here. That Actually, that one will work, because she's got exactly the same. So then we can go with Critter Ranching too, like that. It's got the black hat on there. Um, so we've got some bonuses. So far, it's looking good. This in here, we want to try and get all of that water into an area inside here. So I've got that up there. I've got a double wall on this bit. I just need to kind of get rid of the rest of this double wall. So next we will get rid of those two. Like that, so then they can get that out. And they should start cleaning up a whole load of this. That has now been dug out. He's dug out some of the rest of it. This is a good thing. So I, I want them now to be able to work through. They're stressed. They're very stressed. It's the it's having to work in this water. It is a stressful environment for them. They don't like it. We don't want them to keep having to work in this stressful environment. So we kind of want to keep... Well, I've got another attribute point over here. There's a couple of them. So you've got field research in here that I've already done. Astronomy researching over there, which gives you astronomy. you got the astronomy hat, and then Abe over this side. He's got improved construction. I'm going to give him construction too. Right onto there. 
which means that he can then go with his improved construction hat like that looking good and I'll let the I just want them now to keep working through this and and tidy all of this up I've cleared that bit out of the way over there so as, once they've come through now that's that's what they're doing right now they're, they're focusing mostly on keeping the power going we've got our battery bank nice and full that works well We've also got the air locks in here, so we've got very little oxygen over this side, and this is a carbon dioxide area. So mostly, things are looking pretty good. We have got some long commutes over this side. I want another storage bin here. One, two in there, because we've got some more material for that one that needs to be copied out. So I want to go to you, and that is cultivable soil, which is just dirt in there. So I want to copy the settings from that one and put them into there. We've got the algae is that storage bin right there, isn't it? That's in the organic. Yeah, that is just algae in there. I haven't got anything extra. I have got some stuff that will be able to go in there eventually, but there is none available right now. They're working through this nice and quick. That is one good thing that we can say about this. I can remove that one. And then I can dig that bit. You can dig that one out, and you can also dig that one out down there. They can't reach all of that up there. I'm, this is where I'm going to start lifting up the floor in here a little bit. So that's that bit out. Now I can dig those out. They can be removed, and I can also remove those two right there. I've got more stuff down here that needs... Like granite. Where are we going to put granite? Well, I, haven't, I don't think I've got anywhere to put the granite in, have I? What have I got? This storage bin over here, this filtration medium, that's the same. And you over this side, raw mineral. Uh, no, that is granite. That one will take the granite. We will have it in there. It's just that they've got to bring the stuff over. So we're still waiting on them to bring it over here. Printing pod in here, choose a blueprint. So we can have another person come in. We've got a care package. Puffs and non-aggressive critters excrete lumps of slime with each breath. No, we definitely don't want that right now. Uh, pinch of pepper plant, dig up buried objects, main cover a pinch of pepper. Uh, increase germ resistance, cannot do cooking, cannot do research. Binge eater, vomiter. I don't want a stress reaction of vomiting. I want to avoid having that. A binge eater, that could be fine. Increase food morale bonus, plus seven medicine. I, I think we'll take bubbles this time. Bubbles, you can join us. You haven't got anywhere to sleep. You're sleeping on the floor right now. So we're going to have to allow Bubbles to have a room. Which means that we've got to bring that one out over to there like that. And then we're going to need to go that right there. Just to allow her to have plenty of room to sleep. It's going to extend it out so they've all got beds apart from bubbles in there i've now got duplicate skills in here bubbles needs to have something she is medicine compounding i've got a doctor already so having another doctor i'm gonna have another doctor anyway i think two doctors is probably not a bad thing and we could always uh do something else that gives that does give her a morale bonus as well so i, I think that's a, a good idea so we'll do medicine compounding for you just for a minute We've got a bit of digging to do over this side after they've gone and had a bit of grub. They've made a mess. Where did you make a mess? Please, please, please don't have made... You've made a mess there. We do not want a mess going into our water. This, this is the really, really crucial thing right now. Well, unfortunately, that's all we've got time for for a little while. We need to let the replicants rest. So if you've enjoyed this episode, then please hit down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And I am just going to drag out this farewell just a tiny little bit. Just so that there is enough space and time on the screen to put up a couple lots of you absolutely wonderful supporters of the channel. You should be seeing some of your names coming up now. So until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.